O is for osteoblasts and osteoclasts. Osteoblasts and osteoclasts are two types of cells that our bones have. Throughout our bodies, our cells are constantly being replaced with new cells. This process also happens in our bones. The osteoblasts are our bone building cells and osteoclasts break down old worn out bone cells. This process works well in the body unless our bodies break down much more bone than they build. At some level, this happens for everyone. Adults reach peak bone mass at around age 30, and after that, the body starts to break down more bone than it builds. Women have a large drop off in their bones after menopause, but at some level, this process of breaking down more bone than we build happens to everyone after age 30. If way more bone is broken down than, than is created, osteopenia and eventually osteoporosis develop. Excessive bone loss could happen because of a nutrient deficiency, a medical condition, or taking a medication that causes bone loss, or even not doing exercises that help to keep our bones healthy and strong. It's important to be consistent and to do regular bone building exercise to stimulate new bone growth and to improve the quality of the bones that we already have. So, do you toss in the towel if you have to take a medication that causes bone loss? Personally, I don't think so. Even when things are not ideal, it's important to do what we can. I have a friend who's had cancer, and she has to take a medication to prevent the cancer from coming back. But this medication also causes bone loss. She chooses to take her cancer medication and deal with the bone loss in the best way possible. She's created a bone building lifestyle by eating the right things and also by exercising the right way with consistency. In her most recent DEXA scan, she was really pleased when she realized that she hadn't lost more bone. She was holding steady. While not the ideal, she'd love to be building and increasing and having more bone, for her, just maintaining is a huge win. So even if you have to do something that causes bone loss, it's important to keep working hard and improving your bone health because every bit that we do makes a difference. Please share this information with someone that you know and love. Talk soon.